Hello everybody, it is Desiree and welcome to another episode of our Hong Kong travel series. Today I'm going to show you a whole new world! <laughs> uh, let's get this started, shall we? Good morning guys! So today is our Disneyland day. Um, medyo late na ako nakatulog kagabi. Nahirapan na matulog for some reason kahit napagod na pagod ako. Kaya mga 8am na ako bumangon kanina. Then, um, magta-10 na. Mga 9.50 na yata. So technically late na siya kung yung habol ko yung opening ng Disneyland. Pero, um, bala ko naman magstay until fireworks tonight. So, okay na din siguro yung oras ng pagpunta ko. So yun lang, I'm gonna head out in a while and I'll just show you around again. Um, yun lang. <laughs> From Mini Central Hotel, naglakad ulit ako papunta ng Hong Kong Station. I rode the Tong Chong Line or yung Orange Line papunta ng Sunny Bay Station. And from Sunny Bay Station, lumipat ako din sa Disneyland Line which is the Pink Line papunta ng Disneyland Resort Station. Growing up as a kid in the 90s, books were a huge part of my entertainment. So I read a lot of fairy tales, which include Cinderella, Snow White, The Little Mermaid, Beauty and the Beast, and all those Disney fairy tales. Also, at that time, we still didn't have cable. And yung mga free TV channel na nasasagap ng TV namin, eh hindi din ganun kaklaro. So at that time, either makikinood ako sa kapitbahay or manonood ako ng mga VHS na padala ni Mama. And a lot of them were Disney movies. So in particular, ang pinaka naalala ko na pinapanood ka dati was The Lion King and Pocahontas. My point is, Disney for me with all its stories of adventure, friendship, bravery, love, overcoming adversaries, and of course, happy endings. It reminds me of a more simpler and happier time. Because to be honest, despite my disability and the bullying that came and comes with it, I had a relatively normal and happy childhood. If you're visiting Disneyland, the one thing that I would really recommend for you to do is to download the Disneyland app. So this is the Hong Kong Disneyland app. And kapag naka-share location ka, malalaman mo kung nasan ka na dun sa map. So, for instance, ganyan na. Ito yung map ng Hong Kong Disneyland. Kapag naka-on yung share location mo, mapipint mo it mo kung nasan ka na dun sa map. So, at least, hindi ka na mahihirapan to plan kung ano yung next na ride na pupuntahan mo. Nakalagay din dito usually kung ilan yung mga uh, waiting time ng bawat mga rides. Okay, so dito sa taas, banda, nandiyan, nakalagay yung pwede mong i-click. So, kunwari, maghahanap ka ng mga kainan. Ano ba yung mga available na kainan? So, nakalagay dyan. Kunwari, dito sa... Yan, nakalagay din kung um, ano yung price point niya. Isang dollar sign lang, so that will be a bit cheaper than, for instance, hanap tayo ng mahal. Um, so, dito, kunwari... So, may Main Street Corner Cafe. Nakita nyo, tatlong dollar sign. So, medyo mahal. Ang pinakaginamit ko dito is for the entertainments. Kasi nga, nakalagay dito kung ano yung mga oras na uh, showing yung mga show nila. Kunwari ganyan, nakalagay yung duration niya, 28 minutes. Usually, nakalagay din kung anong oras yung 
um, available na showtime nila. Okay, so forgive me, but I wasn't really able to take a video of the ride. Hindi ko kasi mahawakan yung camera. And naisip ko na ka 4D din kasi siya, so parang kahit na video ko hindi niyo din may enjoy. But just a side note, yung two teen girls dito sa harap ko, sila yung nagasis sa akin na maglagay ng seatbelt ko. Siguro yun yung isa sa mga kinailangan kong i-overcome dito sa solo travel kasi since wala akong kasama, walang tao that will readily assist me kung may mga kailangan ako. So I'd have to ask for help with others. And natuwa naman ako kasi lahat ng hiningan ko ng tulong ay tinulungan naman ako. Um, ay lo ako doon. So, right, this is the fun of your breakfast. Okay, yeah. Ano? Kaya na po ko ng kainan. Okay, I'm gonna eat pa mula. Where exactly should I eat? By the way, hindi advice sa mga dito kayo kumain. Agad-agad. Maybe one meal dito. Just because mahal kasi. Oh, that's nice. I have one. Let's watch for more. Done. Please welcome from the Avengers, Ant-Man and the Wasp.
So, ayan yung mga rides na sasakyan ko. Yung mga walang masyadong trail. So, no roller coaster is coming today. Ayan. So, ngayon, pupunta ako dun sa ayan. The Mickey Mickey and the Wondrous Book. The Storybook Theater. Yes, I'm. 
，請你全程保持喺座位度，將手、手臂同埋腳保持喺樹裏面，係咪？只要交俾你嘅指引我。
welcome you to their lair. However, they do have a few ground rules. I, uh...
This was nearly 7 p.m. and fireworks starts at 8.30 p.m. And as you can see, a lot of people are already saving up spots where they can view the fireworks show later. Kia naman, I followed suit and I bought myself a popcorn and tried to find a good spot in front of the castle and just sat down.
Hi guys, so I'm here now in the hotel from Disneyland. I'm um, already gone and I'm going to sleep now before going to bed. So supposedly, after Disneyland, I'm going to go to the grocery store or the Don Quixote. And I'm going to go to the Don Quixote or some place that I can buy a souvenir. So, when I go out, I'm going to go to the MTR. Because I'm here in the hotel. I'm going to go to the hotel or the MTR. Because I'm here in the hotel. I'm going to go to the hotel or the MTR. Because I'm here in the hotel. Ano to, may malapit na Don Quixote. Kaya lang, nung paglabas ko ng MTR, kasi medyo nalilito pa ako sa exit-exit ko eh. Paglabas ko ng MTR, yung mas malapit is itong hotel compared dun sa Don Quixote. So parang, I spent like maybe a minute or two deciding kung pupunta ba ako, pupunta ba ako, ganyan. Ending, dumiretso ko ng hotel kasi sobrang sakit na nang pa ako as in, as in, gusto ko na siyang, gusto ko magtanggal ng sapatos, gusto ko na magtanggal ng medyas kasi gusto ko na siyang ipahinga or ano ba, yung let my feet breathe, ganun. Kasi feeling ko super constricted niya buong araw. So, yun, um, I'll just figure out na lang kung anong gagawin ko uh, bukas kasi 11am yung checkout ko and gusto ko sana nakapack na yung um, yung mga souvenirs or yung majority ng mga ano, ipapack nakapack na bago pa mag-check out kasi mas prefer ko na um, nagpapack in like a private space compared to a, uh, a public space kasi syempre or at least in my case mas prefer ko yung nagsistruggle ako <laughs> ano to sa, sa private kaysa naman sa public diba so um, yun lang I'll just figure it out tomorrow na lang um, pero mabalik tayo sa Disney so even as a solo, even as a solo traveler like me, sobrang sobrang na enjoy ko siya. Feeling ko na sulit ko naman yung binayad ko, as in yung I was there like ano to nearly lunch time, and I spent the day or I I was there until the fireworks, de ba? So. Uh, yung mga bandang siguro mga 6pm na may, may point na na parang ah, yung ganun, yung parang na, na feeling ko na nag, nagawa ko yung mga gusto ko. Siguro yung gusto ko lang sana na, na hindi ko na, na nasingit is yung river cruise pero aside uh, or apart from that yung most na mga gusto kong puntahan napuntahan ko naman. Ganyan. Um, Siyempre madami pa hindi na ikot doon as in madami pa pero um I guess I'll leave that for next time. But if you're like traveling to go there, if you're planning to go there, I would really suggest for you to spend the whole day. If kaya nyo nang from opening to closing, why not? And if kaya nyo, even better to spend two days there. Lalo na pag may mga kiddos kayo or kung kunare you're like a Disney fan, you would really really enjoy it. And syempre, kung nasa budget nyo din, di ba, mag-Disney Hotel na din kayo. I mean, I wish that was within my budget, pero medyo mahal. Pero maybe, you know, maybe next time kaya natin yon para makita natin kung ano ba yung meron, uh, meron sa mga Disney Hotels. 
So, yun. Yun lang yung masasabi ko. Um, I had a really great day. Tiring, yeah, but but really happy, you know. As happy as, you know, someone like me can be. Yun lang. <laughs> if you like this video, then please like and subscribe. And don't forget to hit that notification bell so you get notified in the next part of this Hong Kong series, which I'm still trying to figure out. But we'll see. <laughs> See ya.